In this video, we are going to introduce a procedural dissection of the urethral hypergastric nerve fascia for locally advanced rectal cancer with adnexal infiltration. The urethral hypergastric nerve fascia, which contains the ureter, the pelvic automatic nerves, and the ovarian vessels in female, is the most easily involved structures in local advanced rectal cancer based on a close anatomical relationship. During a standard TME, the peritoneum is cut open along the sacral reproductive fold. However, when advanced rectal cancer with lateral invasion, surgical plane should be transited to the lateral pelvic space. The space between the urethral hypergastric nerve fascia and the eternal iliac vessels. Thus, the lateral side of the ureter and the autonomic nerves could be evaluated in advance. Here, we provide a video of a female patient with a locally advanced rectal cancer with the left lateral invasion and the left adnexa infiltration as an example to introduce the procedure in detail. The surgery initiated with the traditional TME after the IMA, IMV, what transected. The sick mode colon was mobilized. When the mass was encountered, the surgical plane was adjusted to the non-vascular lateral pelvic space. The peritoneum was cut open. The non-vascular lateral pelvic space between the urethral hypergastric nerve fascia and the internal iliac vessels was entered and dissected. The ureter, the ovarian vessels, and the pelvic autonomic nerves are contained in the urethral hypergastric nerve fascia. The lateral plane of the fascia was identified to be normal. The ovarian blood vessels were transected. The ureter was protected in advance. The local peritoneum was resected along with the tumor. The relationship between the autonomic nerves and the tumor was still unknown. The left of loping tube and the proper ligament of ovary was transected. The surgical plane was converted to the traditional TME plane. To further evaluate the relationship between the autonomic nerves and the mass, the retrorectal space was fully dissected. Then the anterolateral rectal space was dissected dorsally along the fascia proprior of the rectum. A communication with the retrorectal space could be established. With the proper retraction of the rectum, the relationship between the tumor and the autonomic nerves could be further assessed. In this patient, a nerve sparing procedure was achieved. The uteral hypergastric nerve fascia was reserved as an intact fascial layer. With the section both sides of the ureteral hypergastric nerve fascia, surgery could be autonomic, clear, and safe. Here shows the block specimen. All margins are histologically negative. The post-operative course was uneventful. Fascia-oriented dissection with later bleeding and clear autonomy were obtained. Thank you for your attention.